I am on my way to LA. Early morning this morning. We had such a fun night last night. Literally best night, girls night ever. Yeah. It was so random too. So it, it was like night. It was... felt like a teenager again. <laughs> oh like... god, that was the goal. <laughs> but we also like made the best out of like the worst places. <laughs> Anyways, this morning we are gonna go have some breakfast. We are both really excited. All my flyaways are in full spring, full action, huh? Yeah, I will see you guys there. Oh my God, we arrived. Okay, so we're going to a place called Waypoint Cafe. Apparently it is a private airport like right next to this. So if you were ever gonna accidentally see celebrities, you technically accidentally see them here because they have all private jets and like nobody flies into LAX, obviously. They fly into like these smaller airports around. So uh, I'll update you if we see anybody exciting times. famous for their shakes. So excited. <gasps> Let's try it out. Are you ready? <laughs> nothing. Absolutely nothing. Stupid of this. Maybe now. <laughs> <laughs> Is it? There's a hole it's in the straw. straw. With a new straw. Let's we'll see how the straw works. Are you ready? <laughs> oh my god. That's so good. Devin at the front was like, you have to get, and I was like, done, Devin, listen. He like knew, you know, when you like look in someone's eyes and they'd know, Devin knew. Yes. What was it called, do you know? Alma, Yo. like the bag. The <laughs> Alma. <laughs> That's how we remember. Really freaking good, highly recommend. I cannot wait to show you the food. I'm so excited. Oh my God. Oh my God. <gasps> that burrito, shut up. That looks, <laughs> we're gonna share guys. This looks insane. Back in the car, literally the best place. What is, what is on my lashes? <laughs> literally the best place ever. Honestly, one of like, like actual top five breakfast places I think I've ever been to in my life. The atmosphere, the, like it's the, <laughs> Deals of Steel not only gives you great deals, but great suggestions on restaurants. Like we're we're a five out of five right now on all the places that we've been. <laughs> Absolutely amazing spot. If you're ever in LA, it's worth the drive out here. Like you have to do it. It's super cool. Hey, hey guys, I am so sleepy, but I just got to the hotel. It is called the Mayborn and it's here on Beverly Hills. I'm so excited to get here and meet my other girlfriend. Her name is Mahi. You guys will get to know her very well. Anyways, I am. Um, will give you a little room tour because this is supposed to be an incredible hotel. guys i am awake i'm alive passed out last night <laughs> being so tired we are up this morning and we're gonna go to air one i'm so excited to see it i've never seen it if you guys don't know what air one is it's like a extremely bougie really well-known uh, grocery store that has like amazing smoothies and apparently they like collab with uh different celebrities to like make different smoothies and stuff so anyways we're going to get a smoothie we're excited excuse the background but listen <sighs> we're up so give us credit for that thank you <laughs> outfit of the day super cute mahi's outfit of the day look how cute i love your blazer so fun Woo! this is the hotel lobby i didn't get a chance to show you really last night it's beautiful we're actually getting a car service because the car service has complimentary hotel at the mayborn the car service has complimentary hotel is that what i just said <laughs> wow the hotel has complimentary car service so they'll take you around within two miles anywhere so we're gonna go to air one first and uh, then some shopping i think so it'll be good Oh my gosh, we are here. That is Air One. You can't see it, but there's the sign. All right, are you guys ready? I got Regenerata. 
and the Kourtney Kardashian one because we have to try it all. I'm only here for a day, so you know what I mean? Am I gonna drink one of these smoothies? I don't know. That's not the point. The point is we're trying them. Taste test, Air One smoothies, let's go. This is Regenerata, all right? First taste test, here we go. Oh, wow. It's not sweet. I'm thrown off by how bitter it is. Interesting, try it, you tell me. What do you think? Have you ever tried that one, Regenerata? Yeah, right? Four out of 10. Here comes the big kahuna. I forget what it's called, but it's the Kourtney Kourtney Kardashian. Kardashian. Yeah, Kourtney Kardashian one. It's black and white. It's called the detox smoothie. That's what it's called. Oh, wow. That's really good. That's really, really good. Oh my God, you have to try it. Right? Courtney. Wow. I get it. Courtney. Courtney. Yeah, right? Uh, blueberry, banana, coconut. Lots of different coconut. And then like a whole bunch of other like uh, supplements, basically. This is the win. I'm glad I got two now because that's terrible. <laughs> yes. Eight out of 10. Okay, she got Haley Bieber one. This is called strawberry glaze. Are you ready? Oh, yeah. Oh, that's good. It's like a, yeah, strawberries and cream. That's what that tastes like. That's really nice. Eight out of 10. Always room for improvement. Final answer. Just got done at Air One, as you saw. I got a little Air One tote. Look how cute it is. <laughs> Gotta get some sort of souvenir here. And uh, now we're gonna go to Rodeo, do some shopping, and then maybe Italian for lunch. Take you guys along. Hopping into Louis Vuitton to see the Louis Vuitton stamp. Maybe I'll get one for my passport holder, we'll see. Oh my God, look at this one. How good is that? Hey guys, um, update for you. My wonderful client advisor brought us into the uh, VCA room, the like the IP room. And I'm looking at like little capucines here. I wasn't planning on getting a capucines today, but I did see this. And I thought, oh my God, this color is amazing. And that one, that's what we think. Um, I would love it in a cap of scenes. But then I was like, oh, well, I did realize that I do have that Lady Dior. I literally just got it. And I completely forgot that it's literally that color. So I was like, oh, they're both top handle bags. And it's like, can't really justify two bags in like the exact same color that are both the same style. But he brought me this black one. And then there's um, one that has a pink handle. And I was like, oh, that's cute. So he's gonna ring that one too, we'll see. I love a cap of scenes. So like classic and easy to wear. I do like it. He also brought, a cap scenes with a water snake handle, which is pretty. I feel like I have too many other bags that are too similar. It's like a black basic bag, but it's such a good one. It's just like an easy wearable color. Wow, it's fun, go. thank you. And it's leather lined. We're gonna get my Louis Vuitton stamp. I just checked out what it looks like and it is so freaking cute. I was like, all right, it's worthy of the passport book. We have to do one here too. New York and LA, right? And then all the other ones are countries, that's the rule. Where should I put it is the question. Will it fit there? Like there's no way. Oh no, I'm gonna have to, gonna have to take up prime real estate, but like we can agree that this is cute, right? Like we have to take up prime real estate for this one. It's cute enough. Guys, look how freaking cool this book is. I just bought one. It is 101 trunks. And I thought it would just be like such a good thing for a coffee table, but also just a really good gift in general because um, it's like 170 or something like that, which is like, honestly, I have less than I would have guessed that this is. It has all the pictures of trunks in it, which is, you know, iconic anyways. 
really cool. I'm gonna have to do a full unboxing of everything I got today. I got some good stuff. came up here on the Mayborn rooftop to check it out. It's supposed to be really pretty. Just walking in. Oh, you cannot see anything. Wow. And apparently you can see the Hollywood sign from here. I'll show you the pool in a second. Cool is that? You can see it. Let me show you. Right there. How cool. Really pretty view of just Beverly Hills in general too. So nice. area and a little restaurant. Hey guys, just got back to the room. Thought I would give you a bit of a better room tour, but I'm out here on the balcony just kind of chilling out, right? And uh, I look down and I see the cutest thing I've ever seen in my life. Are you ready? This is the balcony, beautiful. That is Beverly Hills. There, well, I guess the whole thing is there. It's like, it's not Rodeo, but it's like the street next to a Rodeo. I don't know. Anyways, are you ready? Look how cute they are. Is this not the cutest thing you've literally ever seen? I feel like I'm gonna sit here all night and just watch them play. <laughs> okay, room tour from the beginning. This is room 468 in the Mayborn in Beverly Hills. It's one of the nicest hotels that you can uh, stay here in Beverly Hills. It is not necessarily um, one of the oldest as far as like history or anything like that, but it is very, very well known for its customer service. And so I thought I would give you a better tour of this room because I know when I got here, I was so incredibly tired. I give you like the quickest rush through view. We'll start. So you walk in the door and this is your foyer here. You walk through, this is the restroom and it has a wonderful tub, which you know what? I really think I'm going to utilize this evening and of course double vanity sink and your water closet and it has wonderful robes you walk in here and this is a bit of dressing room pop through here to the double bed and on this side you have to excuse the mess you have a drawer that is your refrigerator and then you pop this open here has the drinks and wine. And here is snacks. Of course you have a little desk area and then you have the balcony. Balcony is super pretty. You have a little park down below that everybody seems to kind of walk through. Here is the Beverly Hills beautiful sign and it goes all the way over there as well. So yeah, I hope that gives you a little bit better perspective and of course, Large balcony, just two chairs though. Probably could have fit like an actual little sectional over there or something. Actually kind of a bit of a wasted space. I'm sure they could have put like more furniture out there, especially being in California where uh, the weather is always nice. But it's a really nice like fuzzy chair here. This is a little stuffed animal that somebody got my girlfriend that's with me. So you can kind of see the little space here. That is an ironing board that doesn't come with the room. I uh, requested that. <laughs> but yeah, I think I'm going to chill out right now. Mahi, my friend, she is at a birthday party tonight. And that was one of the reasons that she was in LA and we were gonna just hang out like the rest of the time. And it's like a closed birthday. So it would it would have been weird for me to go to. So I am chilling, which I am not mad about it at all while she does that. I was gonna like make a night out of it and like live my best single thriving life doing something like fun by myself, which usually I would totally take advantage of. I have been so busy, <laughs> so busy the last couple weeks. I am so tired, so I am so glad that I have like tonight to just chill out and she'll come back and we'll probably go to like a fun restaurant. And so yeah, it'll be a great time to just chill and enjoy the night by myself. Good morning, guys. It is our last day in LA today. We just packed all of the luggage and we are gonna go up to the rooftop and have some coffee before we go to the Ivy. We were gonna do brunch at the Beverly Hills Hotel and then we decided last second that we would do the Ivy instead because the concierge suggested it. And I think maybe I'll stay at the Beverly Hills Hotel next time I come to LA. So I was like, yeah, I'll just like wait for brunch uh, when I actually stay there. So we're gonna go to the Ivy and then I'm gonna head to the airport, sad times. But I think I showed you a quick like view of the pool yesterday. But uh, yeah, we're gonna go up there because they have really good coffees and um, maybe chill out for a little bit. 
and then uh, yeah, I'll take you guys along. Outfit today is this Ralph Lauren linen dress. Am I wearing linen after Labor Day? Yes, I am. You can't put rules on me. Not really, I just don't care. <laughs> and uh, my new Chanel bag, I actually haven't even unboxed this yet. I love it. It's my first time wearing it. It's gonna be so cute. And the Chanel loafers that I love, the new sunglasses that I just got from Louis Vuitton. I own these in black actually, and I love them so much. I wear them all the time that I got them in the brown version. Little Chanel scarf, Chanel earrings, and yeah, ready to go. Also, I forgot to mention, look at the hair clip. I love this hair clip so much. I uh, have the black one with the CC in the middle, and then I saw this one for, I bought it for a closet sale, and then it never ended up in the closet sale because uh, it matches these earrings, and I love it so much. And so yeah, we are headed off to brunch now. I'll see you there. the ivy was absolutely wonderful don't you think it was really really nice she loved it too and uh, now we're just gonna chill a little bit before I head to the airport so sad to be leaving LA so soon but I'm gonna come back for sure it's like a whole outdoor area yeah how nice is this trip to LA this time and it was so much fun meeting Deals of Steel in person. That was actually so funny. I don't know what I was expecting because we've obviously been friends for a couple years, but seeing someone that you've only seen online for so long and then all of a sudden seeing them in real life is like just a hoot. It was literally like we've been friends for like 10 years. <laughs> and of course it was like so awesome to see my girlfriend Mahi. We met in New York probably like five years ago and we like meet all over. We're so funny. Like we've met in like so many different countries just like randomly on like like a whim of a trip. So anyways, I will see you guys at the airport if anything else exciting happens. Uh, but thank you so much for watching this video. And I have several other vlogs on my channel right now. If you haven't seen any of those, I'd love to see you there too. And until next time, bye.